What's good to hear YouTube? It's your girl Kim Marcy, and I'm back at it again with another freaking video. And today's video is a how to video. Um, my how to videos are up under my grab your snacks and let's chat content because I want you to chat. I'm chatting with you guys, I want you to know, eat, you know, drink. I have some water here. Try and complete this gallon, so got this water. So, like I said, this is a how-to video. Um, my how-to video is up under my girl, Grab Your Snack and Let's Chat, which is another form of girl talk. I just made it, Grab Your Snacks and Let's Chat, because normally I eat snacks with you guys. Um, Y'all know I'm on this healthy lifestyle, so I gotta eat healthy snacks, but I'm not really hungry right now, Um, cause plus I'm gonna eat dinner after this video, so yeah. So, before we get into the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. After you subscribe, you turn that bell on, post notification to, to get notified every time I upload. So, while you at it, subscribe and just hit the button right beside it so you can see when I upload. <laughs> so, yeah, that's that. So, now let's get into the video. Um, I wrote down my topics, my stuff, like I did when I did the, when I do any topic video, I write down. So, let's get into it. So, first of all, like y'all see by the title, it's say how to deal with being the fat friend. So, um, I'm the fat friend. I can insert pictures of me and my friends. Matter of fact... I don't know if y'all are better to tell, but like, this is me. These are my friends. Some of them, you know, I got other friends besides this little circle, but that's me. That's them. And if y'all see, they got on tank tops. Backstory about that. We all went on a girl's trip after we uh, graduated. It's like a little dusty. <laughs> so we all went on a girl's trip after we graduated, whatever. And. We all got matching shirts, but they had tanks because they were smaller, basically. Like, the size shirt I asked for, the woman didn't sell it in a tank top, so I had to get a t-shirt. Yep. Got some toasted chips right here. <laughs> but yeah. So, I know how I did, because I was bigger, so I had to get a different shirt. Know how I use being the fat friend. Um, so, I'm going to tell y'all how to deal with that. First of all, don't let yourself be labeled as the fat friend. Um, you're not just a fat friend. You're a friend, period. If they're your friend, they're your friend. They're not your friend because you look worse than them and they you make them look better or none of that. Because although a person is skinny, they can be ugly. I know. <laughs> although a person is smaller than you, they can be ugly. I know. <laughs> just because you feel like, well, this person feel like this person is, they can be ugly. Everybody's beautiful in their own way. But, all I'm saying is, a person can be ugly. <laughs> so, first of all, you don't deal with it. You're not just a fat friend. That's number one. You're not dealing with it because you're not just a fat friend. You're a friend regardless. And if your friend feel, if a friend makes you feel like that you're just a fat friend, let that friend go. <laughs> Secondly, don't let nobody treat you like a fat friend. I don't know how fat friends get treated because even though I may be the fat friend out of my little circles, I'm talking about with any friends I'm with. I'm talking about anybody I'm with. I'm the biggest one. Although I may be the fat friend, what am I trying to say? 
I'm the most outspoken friend. I'm the most outspoken. Um, the low key, nice. I know everybody, but I'm low key mean if you want to say that. Um, and I don't take nothing from nobody, friend. That's me. I'm that friend. I'm not gonna take nothing from no nobody, nobody at all. And it's not because I'm fat. I do that. That's just who I am. I'm not gonna take. Even if I was to lose weight, I feel like I'd still be the same person. You're not going to treat me like nothing. You're not going to do me wrong. So don't let nobody treat you like you ain't nothing because you something. And that's just that on that, period. <laughs> You're more than just the fat friend. It's been plenty of times I know. And it gets hard being a fat friend. No lie. Because at young ages, I will say that when you're young, because I know a lot of older people be like, you know, or a lot of people, I'll just say like 22 and up, we'll just say that. But at young ages, with these young minded young males in this world, they be like, um, you feel that you don't have, don't nobody, um, what am I trying to say? Nobody wants you. They want every other friend in your circle but you because you're the fat friend. That's not. That's just because you're dealing with young-minded. I'm young, so I can pay myself, you know. <laughs> but you're dealing with immature young males, and that's the reason why. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> or immature females. Hmm. <laughs> So, don't ever feel discouraged about being, you know, being the bigger friend or being the fat friend or the plus size friend because you still, if that's your friend, they'll love you regardless. Also, don't, um, don't feel bad for, Don't try to change because of your friend. If you're trying to change or if you're trying to lose weight or anything, do it for yourself. Matter of fact, don't do it for nobody else but yourself. But still, I know how it is. Like, if you all get together to go out to a party or something, and everybody else got this on, but you didn't put this on because you know it doesn't flatter you. Don't feel discouraged because you feel like, well, I'm just the bigger one out of the group, so I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to go with none of that. Don't do it. Lead me to dressing. Dress well. When you dress good, you feel good, you look good, everything just starts. Mm, work it in your, in, your, in your way, in your order, in your spirit. <laughs> dress well. Dress good. If you feel good, you look good. If you look good, you will feel good automatically. That's just thing honey so dress well and try to look well and then see how how that works out for you you know if you um let's see yeah look and feel good and don't be uncomfortable never be uncomfortable never try to be uncomfortable never be uncomfortable around your friends nothing you put on nothing that you dealing with you don't have you like you don't have to change something because they like it or something like that. Don't be uncomfortable. I don't recommend that at all. Because, like, although I see my friends can wear the leather, the leather um, short skirts, if that's uncomfortable on me, I'm not wearing it. Anything uncomfortable, I'm not wearing it. I don't care. <laughs> uh, don't let your friends discourage you. Be be yourself, like I'm saying. Be yourself. If you know, if you feel that in your heart, you're a good, genuine person, and then I'll, you, um, you're just the plus size friend or whatever. You're still a good person. I'm pretty sure your friends love you for who you are. Um, me and Ty are best friends because ever since fifth grade, I've been big all my life, literally. So ever since fifth grade, Ty and I caught on to like it to me. And we just not been friends. It's nothing changed. Um, she just continued to like me for who I am. Um, 
all my close friends especially, like, I never had a friend be like, well, I don't know what they say behind, you know, their back or my back, but I don't have no friends that I don't trust. How about that? So, if you don't trust a friend, you need to let them go anyway. And if you feel like that friend probably say something behind your back about your weight or something, you need to address it and let them go anyway. <laughs> but I never had that problem with a friend, and I just feel like being a fat friend is the only, only problem with being... Only thing that I feel like this is, is you're just a friend that sticks out like a sore thumb. But if you stick out like a sore thumb, you better paint that, you better paint that thumb up and look the best you can be. Like, it's been plenty of times, me and my friends, I took group pictures and I know I was bad. I just was like, because <laughs> people, because cause I can dress for one. <laughs> and I just. <laughs> like I do say it like that's what I do, you know. Cause period. <laughs> but don't ever and if you're around friends that you feel like down you if they make slick comments. If they make any slick remarks, drop them as a friend. Let them go. Cause I'm telling you, you don't have to be friends with a person because of who they are or because of if you feel like the loneliness of the friendship. I haven't been friends with nobody that I felt like made me feel like, okay, you're fat or you're too big to be with us. So, mm -mm. never had that problem. Never had that problem. And if I felt uncomfortable, I'll leave. I'll leave. If I felt like, um, if I feel like this is just not the place for me, or even if, if that's anywhere I go, if I feel uncomfortable, if I don't feel like I like it or I feel just out, or if I feel like I'm sticking out like a sore thumb sometimes, and I don't want to just paint that thumb, I'm going to leave. Because you don't have to be around them. You don't have to be there. And you can find other friends. And that's why I tell a lot of people about me coming to college. It's different from being in my hometown in high school because I was confined to them. So now that I'm in college, the world is open to everyone, and I don't have to just be the fat friend. Because it's not only the fat friend, it's the skinny friend, it's the tall friend, it's the short friend, it's the the cute friend, it's the ugly friend. Like, it's always that, and it's the smart friend, it's the dumb friend. Like, it's always all of that. It's not just the smart, it's not just the fat friend. So each friend goes through something different or each friend feels something different. And if they don't, they just don't. They just okay for I'm just cool with them. But uh, you don't have to just consider yourself the fat friend. You can just be a friend. Like I feel like I feel like society makes it you're the fat friend. So that's why people consider themselves fat friends. But you're just a friend. You're not the fat friend. You're the friend. And you just um, deal with it however you want to deal with it. You you either go on about it and let it slide. I mean, just be cool with it. Or you don't. And if you're not cool with it, then you need to... If you're not cool with it for yourself, then you need to change something within yourself. If you're not cool with it with your friends, or if your friends make you feel uncomfortable, then if they're a real friend, you can go to them and tell them. If they're not a real friend, you need to distance yourself and just leave them alone. So, that's my little rant about being the fat friend or how to deal with being a fat friend. You can deal with it or not deal with it. The choice is yours. <laughs> the choice is yours. <laughs> so, that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn that bell right beside the subscribe button on for the post notification if you want to get notified when I upload any of these wonderful videos. I upload Monday through Friday. So if you want to get upload every day Monday through Friday, then turn that bell on for post notification so you won't miss a upload. And if not, I upload Monday through Fridays at 3 p.m. Ha! Ah. So that's the end of the video. Love you guys. Bye!